Good morning, St. Mary's. It's Cor. And it's Kames. Hope you're having a fantastic day so far. Kames, what have we got in student life today? Well, this week, once again, we continue to celebrate Latinx Heritage Month here at St. Mary's. With more information is Inclusive Communities, Mira. This is Mira from Inclusive Community, and in honor of Latinx Heritage Month, we would like to acknowledge Frida Kahlo. Kahlo was a Mexican painter known mainly for her portraits and depictions of Mexican artifacts and nature. Her work focused on themes of identity, love, and pain through surrealist style self portraits. When Kahlo was a teenager, she was severely injured in a bus accident that almost took her life. While in recovery and in a full body cast, she began to paint depictions of herself in physical and emotional pain. Kahlo's work inspired many artists and continues to be influential today. Thanks, Mira. And reminder, Panthers, Thursday, October 1st from 9 a.m. to 9.25 a.m. will be a required Zoom C-Block meeting. And Panthers, remember the NBA 2K20 tournament has begun. If you signed up, please check your email to see you play next. Paul out. And make sure your family and friends complete the census by Wednesday, September 30th. Take your iPad or computer and go to my2020census.gov and help out any grandparents or elderly neighbors that might need it. It only takes 10 minutes to answer nine simple questions that help determine the dollars that fund important programs for the next 10 years. Programs include emergency services, children's nutritional programs, housing, education, and even job creation. Make sure everyone counts. And CSF is back. You can now apply to both the winter and spring 2019-2020 trimester. You will be able to download the membership application on PowerSchool's lower left-hand menu. Applications are due back to Ms. McManus by Friday, October 9th. And in club news today, we have another message from the Democracy Project. Our goal this year is to educate the St. Mary's community about how to vote, why to vote, and how you can be involved in the process of this year's election, even if you're not 18 yet. Watch the first presidential debate tomorrow on Tuesday. Some of the topics covered will be COVID-19, the Supreme Court justices, and racial injustice. Follow us on Instagram at ST Mary's Democracy Project. We will put a poll on Instagram for those who want to be a poll worker. And in other club news, the following clubs meet tomorrow. At noon, we have Celebrating Cultures and Traditions, Environmental Club, and Rock Climbing. At 1 p.m., we will have Panther Road Biking Club, NHS for Dance Arts, and Songwriting. And at 2 p.m., we have Mock Trial, Creative Writers, and a Yearbook. And in counseling today, seniors, we have even more colleges who signed up for virtual visits this week. In addition to the ones I mentioned on Friday, we will also have Loyola Marymount, Holy Names, Point Loma Nazarene, and Lafayette College. Don't miss this opportunity to meet with admissions reps and get your burning questions answered. As always, sign up in Naviance as soon as you can. And before we get into today's birthdays, we forgot a very important birthday on Friday. Big happy belated birthday to Miss Panlilio. And for today's birthdays, we want to wish a very happy birthday today to Luis Centeno Ontiveros, Nicholas Cambulu Doherty, Sylvia Thomas Montes, and Niepa Westerman. And tomorrow, we'd like to wish a very happy birthday to Alexis Bernstein, Alejandra Tejeda Gonzalez, and Dr. Imperial. Happy quarantine birthday, staying at home and having a blast time your quarantine birthday. Rocking that party hat and your homemade mask, trendy cut, happy butt, six feet of room, sanitized hands and a party on Zoom. Can you hear me? You need to unmute. Unmute! Have a super great birthday, all your friends wish they could be near, but your quarantine birthday means you get to have another birthday next year. That's all for now, Panthers. Have a great day, St. Mary's.